How's it going, everyone? We are going to be playing some Explorers levels today. And if you don't know what Explorers is, Explorers is the Rob Top Demon level that was supposed to come out with Geometry Dash 2.2, but it got pushed back to be released at a later date. However, there's people that have made some Explorers levels, their own takes on what Explorers might be like, and so we're going to play them. So once you've seen all the levels, I'd like you to rank them all in order and tell me how much you like them. The first level we're going to be playing is Explorers Full by Seg4M. Let's go. So this is the first one we're going to be playing today. And now, you know what? Explorers, I think, the uh, the preview that we got dropped for it, um, I actually ended up playing it because someone recreated it in the GDPS editor. And it's, uh, you know what? It's a good level. It's really fun, except there's one part that is like super insane that has like these fast transitions. If you hit any of those squares, you die. This part, like this part is crazy. And so I got to practice it. That part makes it a demon. You got it. You got it. Oh my God. You, you, you got to know what's coming up, you know, like you need to know exactly. It doesn't give you any time to read. It gives you no time to react. It's pure, pure memorization. Ow. Oh my God. And then that wave at the bottom. That's, that's ridiculous, dude. Dude, that's, that's so ridiculous. Look at this. Oh my God. This part right here, if this stays in Explorers when the full level gets released, you better bet there's going to be a 30 minute colon video about this part. <laughs> rightfully so, though. Absolutely rightfully so. And I'll, I'll have his back on it. That's ridiculous. I'm going to have to practice that again. But let's see. Let's see what the rest of the level's like. This part I found was pretty tricky, too, but it's not as tricky as like the cross part. Oh, yeah, this is this is chillaxed. So this is all a part of what was in the uh, preview um, that Rob Top had made. The Explorer's preview. And then from now on, I think it's all new. Except I think the boss fight was teased a little bit. Except we didn't know like... Whoa, that's fast. Except we don't know like the full extent of what this was going to be like. So, whoa, it's pretty tricky wave gameplay. I'm definitely into it though. Oh my goodness. That's fun, man. That's fun. Oh, dude. it's a, It changes you into mini in that tight space. Woo! Woo! Holy... Dude. That's, this is so insane. That part was challenging. It was nuts. Oh, this is cool. Oh, this is cool. It's a little like, a uh, little climb up. Ow. I transitioned pretty nuts. Okay. Fire! Yes! We need the fires in all the holes. This is, it's really fun though. It's really challenging, but it is really fun. I'm totally, I'm really into this. Let's go. Oh, dude, it's an asymmetric duel. This level is nuts. This, I'm getting chased again. This level is so hard. I didn't, ex I didn't expect this. I knew it was going to be challenging. But I thought it was going to be like an easy medium demon. Dude, this is this is definitely... We're getting some hard demon action here. The ship parts are pretty chill, though. I got to admit that. Oh, 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 they were. Oh, they weren't. But the, this, uh, the skulls. What is this firework? It's, this is... It's a really good level. It's just, man, it's just a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Okay, a little chill end. Nice. Kind of reminds me of the deadlocked end. Good. The ending. The ending's massively chill. But the rest of the level's crazy! I had to practice this a lot. This is... It was way harder than they thought it was gonna be. I did, like, two full practice runs, and I spent a long time on each section. Oh, man. I'm nervous. Oh, my God! I first try! Oh, my God! I'm killing it, dude. I got, I got through some really hard parts. I'm crushing it. You dummy, you were gonna fall down. I'm so bad at transitioning into swing copter still. No, that was like such a killer run. Cause it, I got there's really hard parts, trust me. It's way harder than it looks. Oh no, it begins. Oh it's just right in the way! It comes up just right there! Oh come on, dude. That's the hardest part of the level. I can't get past the stupid skulls. What the no? No, what do you when you go through those portals, it just like usually you just get it. Oh what the Oh I've never died like that. I just Oh arr. Again
fire in the hole! I almost died. I almost died like three times. Oh, no! oh my god, it's it's a pretty good level. This is way harder than I thought it was gonna be. Holy shoot, dude. It it looks like it's pretty easy when you see it, but it's not. Woo! A very cool imagining of what explorers could potentially be. Okay, the next one isn't so much a reimagining of explorers, but it's like Dash combined with explorers, and it's really cool, and so I wanted to include it in this video. Explore the Dash Explorer is a secret dungeon that will start a multiversal travel in Geometry Dash. Really, really cool. A really cool idea. So let's let's see, let's see what it's all about. So it starts out like it's explorers, right? And uh, it has some extra cool effects with it as well. I like it in the way things are popping in. Oh yeah, that's cool. Now let's see, it does it stick. Oh, dude, it cuts out the real annoying owl. I see, that's a jump. I, I should just practice this. It cuts out the, the annoying cross section of explorers. Thank God! You know what? The cross section in explorers, it isn't necessarily, uh, the concept is cool. It's just like transitioning at each, between each gameplay part is, uh, could be tweaked a little bit. Oh, I like how that flows. Okay, that's cool. It looks a little chaotic at first. But it's it's pretty cool. Oh yeah, and then this is back from like explorers, man. Oh, it's cool. Okay, it's cool. It's, it's just a mix. It's a mix of like new and old ideas for explorers. And then there's also gonna be like some dash parts coming up. That's cool, man. I'm 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 into this. This is cool. Oh dude, dude, this part's wild. You like go loop all the way around, and then you go up, dude. It, it's actually I thought that was gonna be way harder than it actually was, dude. This wave part is sick. That was that's such a cool. That wave part was incredibly good. I've, I don't think I've played a wave part that has like camera controls like that, that has experimented like that. That was so cool. And this is a nod to uh, Dash, I think this part right here, like the tower climb, but it's not a tower climb. Oh, and here now, now it's the beginning of Dash. Oh, it's beautiful, but it's different. It's different enough, man. Oh, when it's slow mos like that, I'm just so used to it being like Geometry Dash. This level's pretty tough. It is a sick level. It is, this is incredibly fun. Oh my God, is it ever good? Oh, dude, I hit, did you see that? I thought I was gonna clear that and just go right up and then I hit the edge of it and it messed me up. Oh man, I was crushing it. What the, no, you, oh God. Why, oh, you gotta hold that lightly. That's such a dumb death.
Yo, dude. Oh, wait, I'm not done. There we go. <laughs> well, I almost forgot about those. Dude, that is so good. That's such a sick level. Dash floors. Oh my God, it's so much fun. I, I, I think it should be rated, honestly. That's such a good level. That wave is so sick. I'm gonna, I'll forever remember that wave. This level flows well. It's, it's well balanced. It's really fun. All the parts are really fun. The camera controls seem really hectic at first, but it doesn't require that many inputs when it's rotating. It's like, it's not that bad. Like you get used to it pretty easily. It's really well made. It's a really solid 2.2 level. Back to the regularly scheduled programming. We're doing another explorer's imagining of what it could possibly be. This one by Emil Exito. The explorers that might be. Um, I'm just going to jump into practice mode right away. These have all been pretty exceptionally difficult today. Okay, so this is, uh, it's a faithful recreation of explorers. Yeah. Oh, that's way easier. The skulls there are like smaller. Okay, and this is the same. There's no skull there. Oh, dude, the spikes are smaller in the wave too. So we get to the wave. Now this is a version of the boss fight uh, for here. And uh, it's cool. Oh, dude, do you have to go inside that lava? That's hard. Oh, that's not that hard to do. Okay, cool. And I like how I get the sword and it kills the boss. Nice. Okay, this one gets pretty fast paced though. Whoa, whoa. It, there's some, some sudden transitions. It's it's pretty intense at this part. I like this part. Ooh, okay. Yeah, this is cool. I like this part. Ah, ha, ha, ha. sometimes it's hard to see where you're jumping to though. You know? Oh, dude, the, the orb, you can't even see it. It's like off the screen. What are you, what, what? what? Whoa, dude, it gets so nuts. Okay. And then the spike moves. It goes down. Hi. Okay. Oh, boy, dude, dude. Okay. This is cool. I'm into this. There. Oh. There's definitely some really hard blind jumps in this level. Without the blind jumps, I think the level would be pretty good. But, there, man, there's some blind jumps. All right. Oh, dude, this... Oh. No, dude! <laughs> I don't understand why the screen stays in that spot when it could just keep on moving and show you what's coming up, but, like, it makes it a blind jump for no reason! Just keep the screen moving! I told you I was going to fluke the ending. I went from like 45 to the end. Just like the middle part from like 30 to 45 is really, really hard. And there's blind jumps and the screen moves kind of weird. Other than that, it's it's really fun. It's a really good level. It's just, uh, there's just some moments, you know?
There's some moments that make you want to rip out the last little bits of remaining hair that you have on your head. Anyways, it was overall pretty solid though. Like it, it gets pretty consistent. It's just the, the you, you got to know the blind jumps and stuff. So once you've seen all the levels, I'd like you to rank them all in order and tell me how much you like them. But anyways, now that I've beaten all three of these, Dash Blurs, I liked a lot. It was probably my favorite, um, but they're all like fairly good levels, you know? A lot more challenging than I thought they were going to be. Ex these Explorers uh, full versions or the Explorers imaginings uh, were quite a lot more difficult than I thought, just because there's some transitions that are nuts. A few blind jumps here and there. Um, or just it being extremely like more tight than it looks. Even though it looks like it's wide open with some of the swing copter sections, it's a lot tighter than you think. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you in the next one. Leave a thumbs up, helps me out a lot. And as always, peace.